I'm Gail Simmons from Bravo's Top Chef, and it is grilling season. One of the things I love to do when I have guests over is the first thing they arrive, give them a drink. Give them something to sip, cool them down while I'm finishing the food. And I want to keep it easy by giving them one signature cocktail instead of having to run around customizing a drink for everyone. My charred pomelo twist is exactly that. It uses fresh juices, fresh herbs, and it's easy to batch for a big group. Infusing smoky, charred, grilled flavor into things like cocktails. It's really fun and easy to do. I'm using ruby red grapefruits that I've actually charred on the grill. It gives them that delicious, juicy, smoked flavor. Once I've juiced them after I've grilled them, I'm going to pour that juice into a cocktail shaker, and I'm going to add some fresh cilantro. This gives a great herbaceous note. Muddle that together. And then I'm going to add a little sweet tea. I'm thrilled to be partnering with Pure Leaf Iced Tea because it's made from real tea leaves and I'm really obsessed with realness and fresh flavor. Top it off with a little sweet tea. Add a little ice and shake it together. Now, I'm serving it in a glass that I've actually rimmed with smoked salt. That smoked salt enhances that grilling theme and that idea that makes it really taste like it's right off the grill. Top it like that. And a little sprig of, co a little, another little sprig of cilantro to top it off. And that's the perfect cocktail. Now you need to move on to your main course. What do you want to make that's going to impress your guests and pack your meal with flavor? I love grilling salmon. It doesn't weigh people down. It's really heavy and it also has this beautiful bright color. If you use a lot of color in your food, you know it's going to taste fresh and delicious. The more color, the better. So grilling salmon is always a great way to go. I'm serving it on a bed of greens and the key to this dish is actually to marinate the salmon in advance that you can infuse with lots of flavor and make sure that it really packs a punch when you put it on the grill. I'm actually going to use as my base to the marinade some unsweetened tea. When I then add things like chili, ginger, a little garlic, the whole dish really comes together. I can separate out some of the marinade before the fish goes in and use that as a salad dressing. I then throw it on the grill and serve that salmon over some fresh greens, a little cucumber salad, or whatever veggies you have on hand topped with that beautiful dressing too. Sprinkle with a little sesame and it's the perfect summer grilled dish that always looks and tastes beautiful. Now you need dessert. So any dessert you want to do, keep it fresh and keep it simple. I love actually keeping with this grilled theme, grilling fruit itself. Grill things like peaches, pineapples, a little scoop of fresh vanilla ice cream, and you're good to go. For more recipes and more tips for grilling, go to pureleaf.com. Happy summer.